Hi, I'm Mark Michelson, Editor-in-Chief of Printing Impressions, and welcome to this edition of Impressions Exchange. It's my real pleasure to have with me today Alan Spaeth, who's the co-founder of Ryan and Spaeth, Inc. in uh, Chicago, Illinois. Welcome, Alan. Thank you. Good to be here. My pleasure. So how long has uh, your company been in business? Uh, we've been in business since 2013, so this is our eighth year. How did you uh, start your journey into uh, dye sublimation printing? Well, originally when we started, we were a small three-person operation and we were outsourcing to a larger uh, print group uh, our dye sublimation products. And uh, over the course of a few years when we started to grow, we felt we really needed to be able to take that on in-house so that we could make the process faster and then expand our product line. What uh, types of products are you guys producing? We, our largest uh, division of the company provides uniforms for high school and college marching bands, as well as flags for color guards, drill teams. And also we do uh, flags for cities, for municipal um, buildings. The uh, city of Chicago, if you watch any press conference with the mayor, behind her will be all of our flags and uh, things that we dye sublimate here in Chicago. So you installed a, uh, a DGI uh, Poseidon dye sub printer from Canon Solutions America. Um, when did you install it and, and what prompted that? We, we are looking for a, a faster printer to be able to produce more volume of products. And we reached out to Lan at Canon after doing a lot of research. Uh, most of our other plotter printers and fine art printers that we have here are Canon. And we were excited to learn that Canon was getting into the dye sublimation printing uh, industry, and we were introduced to the DGI Poseidon, and it really fit all of the needs for us in terms of range of color, speed of printing, cost of raw materials. It was a big factor in us choosing this printer. What most surprised you about the, the dye sub process itself? We were surprised that it's something that a small company can do. Uh, we... When we first started, we were three employees. Uh, once we introduced our own dye sublimation printer, we were pressing our own fabrics. Uh, it really gave us, the, the world, the impression that we were a bigger company. And, you know, we were surprised how easy it was to use, how we were able to self-train and educate ourselves about the dye sublimation process. And it really sped up our, our production process and gave us just opportunities to create a huge range of products. Well, you know, now that that printer is, is in your operation, what, what did you find to be unique about the Poseidon? What's unique about it, the, uh, the maintenance on it is very easy. Uh, for a big industrial printer that has this sort of how with the speed and volume of print that it can do in one day, uh, we thought it would be a lot harder to maintain and to operate. And it's been just the opposite. It's been very easy to use, to learn how to operate the machine. And the, the process of um, uploading files and everything through the, the Onyx RIP system has been very easy and seamless to create what we need to have done. The, the install team at Canon really made the process very easy. They showed us everything we needed to know. They kept checking in with us. If we have a problem, we can call them. And 95% of the time, it's something that we can fix very quickly over the phone. Uh, it's, it's been a very seamless process. You're also outputting a lot of fluorescent colors. You know, how, how important has that been to, uh, you know, to, your, to your product line? When we were looking to upgrade uh, into a bigger print system, that was one of the things we were looking for. It's a pretty important arsenal in terms of color uh, when we can produce fabrics that have, you know, just vibrant colors. The color range that we're able to access through the Poseidon, um, it really it helps set us apart from our competitors because very few people have the, the fluorescent capabilities. Uh, so it was, for us, it was one of the things that we were looking for. Uh, and the Poseidon, what's great about the fluorescent system is the, it doesn't slow the printer down. The printer, it still prints at a high rate of speed. 
Uh, so, you know, we have the, the ability to access more colors, more color ranges, and then the, the speed isn't impacted. So it's been a really great fit. What do you see as um, kind of the biggest challenges in uh, textile printing and, and how has the Poseidon, you know, helped to, to solve those problems? Probably the biggest problem uh, is just maintenance, confidence, uh, no, you know, not so much what's right now with the printer, but what happens when you, when you run into a problem. And with Canon, we found if there's problem or uh, something we don't know how to do, we have the ability to reach out and get quick answers um, to help us keep moving forward. It, it's the, this process is fairly simple. It's just making sure that as a small company that we have access to technical expertise when we need it. And with Canon, it's been seamless. It's been very good. Now, were you doing some dye sub printing before, or was the Poseidon your your first uh, foray into that process? This is our third printer that we've gotten. Uh, in each time, we've tried to increase the speed and uh, try to find ways to reduce costs of ink and paper. And with Poseidon, it's been a definite savings in terms of paper costs and ink costs. And the speed of production has really been able uh, to open up room for us in our production schedule you know given the given the options out there i mean there's different printers on the market you know what what prompted you to to kind of zero in and and decide that the poseidon uh printer was the right one for you after doing our research uh and looking at other brands it, it was canon's uh service after the sale it was the uh the ability to have a printer that had the color range and the speed and uh, easy maintenance. That was the biggest part of what we needed. We needed uh, a printer that we knew would stand the test of time, but if it needed repairs or uh, any service after the sale, that we would be able to get that quickly and efficiently and, and cost effective through Canon. You know, I guess as a closing question, what other advice would you give to other printers uh, when it comes to uh, printing textiles? That a company of any size can really benefit from a dye sublimation system. The ability to change products quickly during the pandemic, we went from providing marching band uniforms to making masks for uh, the general public. And we were able to just switch over our product line immediately having our own printing process in-house. Great. You know, thank you so much for your time today, Alan, and much continued success to you and uh, your team at uh, Ryan and Spade. Thank you. It's great to be here. My pleasure. And to all our viewers, thank you so much for watching Impressions Exchange. We'll see you next time.